welcome to Grilling with Spice. My name is Cheyenne Ledyard. I'm your host and pitmaster here in beautiful Charleston, South Carolina at the Den. Today on Grilling with Spice we're going to be talking about shrimp scampi and snow crab legs and how to grill both of them. Check. Oh, check out that garlic butter. Shrimp scampi's bubbling. Garlic butter's ready to go. Are you guys ready for a great segment? After these words from our sponsors, it's time to barbecue. Welcome to the barbecuepantry.us. We are your barbecue headquarters. From sauces to rubs to barbecue kits, we have what you need to take your barbecue from good to great. We also specialize in gift kits and gift baskets. So this holiday season, remember the barbecue pantry. The barbecue pantry. Dot US where it's always time to barbecue all right so today we're gonna to be doing shrimp scampi as you see here I've got a couple shrimp garlic clarified butter one with some lemons and then a Greek herb dry rub from the barbecue pantry we'll begin with the shrimp I've already cut shell off of them and deveined them We'll take and add a little bit of the clarified butter over top. Pinch of garlic. And some lemon. Making sure not to get any of the seeds into the shrimp. We'll take and put a little pinch of the dry rub right over top. And then we'll add this to the grill down. Okay, now that we've completed the shrimp scampi, I'm going to show you guys how to set up the grill down so that you have perfection in your grill. Right this way. I had the shrimp scampi here. And as you can see, I have the grill down set up about a quarter bag of charcoal, nice and hot. The grill down is set to 400 degrees. We're going to set the shrimp scampi right there in the center on the bottom grate, close to the fire. Now, three to five minutes, and those will be done. Okay, shrimp scampi should be almost done. The grill dome's holding at 400 degrees. Oh my, those are looking great. Remove them quickly off the grill though, because you don't want them to get rubbery and overcook the shrimp. Today, along with our shrimp scampi, we're gonna be doing some crab legs. I've got some snow crab leg clusters here, straight from the Bering Sea. And all you have to do, these are still frozen, is add those right to the grill dome. I've got the grill dome at about 400 degrees. Let me show you how that's done. So we have the snow crab legs here. We're gonna add those straight to the grill. We have the grill dome set to about 400 degrees. Same as the shrimp scampi. We're gonna add the crab legs right to the center grate. See, now I have the top grate. Add your clusters. Along with one stick of butter that's been clarified. The rest of your garlic from the shrimp scampi. We're going to add a pinch of herb seasoning. And then a little lemon juice. Being sure to keep the seeds out. We're going to shut that down. In about five minutes, your crab legs will be done. So it's been about five to six minutes. Let's check these out and see how they're looking. Oh my. Those As you can see, the great. garlic butter is just now starting to come to a boil. So we know that's done. Along with the crabs. And if you can look at the back here, you'll see a little bit of foam. You've seen that's turned white. Pretty much a good indicator that they're done. If you go any further than this, what will happen is the crab meat will actually start sticking to the shell. If you notice that your crab meat is sticking to the shell when you're cracking these open, then you know you've cooked them just a little too long. Next time you want to go just a little bit less time on the grill or over the fire. But let me take these off and we're going to have some good eating tonight.